How Elon Musk Makes and Spends His Billions Elon Musk has been one of the most powerful and richest men on the planet in the past decade or so. He is one of the most talked about technology entrepreneurs and the owner of Tesla and SpaceX companies. His estimated total net worth is around $134 billion. Have you ever asked yourself how the 49-year-old South African-American spends his money? Well, if you have, then you are in luck because in this video, we will show you precisely what he does with his insane amounts of money. But first, an overview of how he makes the money. Let's get it on. Reportedly, Elon Musk is a total workaholic and spends most of his time at work or at one of his four Los Angeles mansions. Musk signed the Giving Pledge Initiative in 2012 that made him vow to donate the majority of his wealth to charity during his lifetime, even though his main focus is on improving the environment and the future. He has still managed to make huge amounts of donations. Musk spends money on homes, cars, and charities, but he also invests significant amounts back into his companies, from SpaceX to Tesla. Elon Musk is the face of some high-profile firms. Musk grew up in South Africa, and he taught himself how to code. At just 12 years old, he sold the source code for his first video game for $500. Then, at age 24, Elon and his brother, Kimbai, founded Zip2 with about $28,000 of their father's money. Zip2 provided a searchable business directory, almost like an online version of the Yellow Pages with maps. Four years later, the brothers sold Zip2 for a staggering $307 million. Musk used his $22 million share to co-found the online banking service X.com. Via merger, X.com ended up becoming PayPal, with Musk as a majority shareholder. When eBay acquired PayPal in 2002 for $1.5 billion, Musk made $180 million in profits from the sale. The father of seven and other PayPal executives like Peter Thief and Reid Hoffman have become known as the PayPal Mafia. They took their gains from the PayPal sale and put them into various startups and funds. Their investment and creations include YouTube, LinkedIn, Uber, and countless others that have become major players in Silicon Valley today. Following the PayPal sell, Musk founded Space Exploration Company, SpaceX. SpaceX's self-described mission is to enable humans to become a space-faring civilization and a multi-planet species by building a self-sustaining city on Mars. Musk himself is the largest individual shareholder of SpaceX, with a 54% stake. While SpaceX shoots for the stars, Musk is well known for a company that's at least a little bit more down to earth. Automaker and energy company Tesla, which was founded in 2003, it went public in 2010. Although Tesla helped build Musk's future, the future of the company remains unclear. In 2018, Musk had to pay a $20 million fine and had to step down as chairman for three years after triggering an SEC investigation when he tweeted about taking Tesla private. Still, the company's current valuation is pegged at $34.309 billion. Impressive statistics for sure. He technically has a salary of $56,380, but for legal reasons, he doesn't cash the paychecks. Instead, all of his compensation comes through awards based on the company's success. As if outer space and our highways weren't enough, another Musk venture is looking underground. Musk has also founded The Boring Company, an infrastructure and tunnel construction company that hopes to build underground tunnels with an all-electric transportation system. Musk was inspired to start the company after experiencing the notoriously bad traffic of Los Angeles. According to the tech mogul, The Boring Company's first commercial tunnel will be operational in a few years. This and other high-profile contracts, like the one with Chicago's O'Hare Airport, is estimated to cost a good $16 billion. With all of these ambitious projects, Musk has amassed an incredible fortune. So how does one of the world's wealthiest people spend his fortune? Well, here's how. Number one, cars. Not surprisingly, the electric car CEO also owns a few interesting vehicles. In a 2013 Sotheby's auction, Musk paid nearly $1 million for a rare 1978 Lotus E-Spirit sports car that was used in the filming of the 1977 James Bond film, The Spy Who Loved Me. 
Musk's garage also includes a 1920 Ford Model T, which he says was a gift from a friend's, as well as a Jaguar Series 1, 1967 E-Type Roadster, in 2017, Musk said that those two cars were the only two gasoline-powered cars he owns, though he previously owned everything from a 1978 BMW 320i, the first car he ever owns, to a McLaren F1, a rare sports car that Musk said he wrecked in 2000 after buying it for $1 million. In July 2019, Musk said on Twitter that he mostly drives Tesla's Model S, performance sedan. The billionaire has also been spotted driving Tesla Cybertruck around Southern California. Number two, philanthropy. In 2012, Musk joined the likes of Warren Buffett and Bill Gates in signing the Giving Pledge Initiative, promising to contribute a majority of his wealth to charitable organizations over the course of his lifetime. In 2015, he gave $10 million to the Future of Life Institute, which is aimed at ensuring that artificial intelligence technology is beneficial to humanity. And in 2016, he reportedly donated Tesla stock valued at $255 million to his own charitable foundation called the Musk Foundation. It's worth noting that a 2019 investigation by The Guardian found that while the Musk Foundation had donated millions of dollars to roughly 160 charities over nearly two decades, the foundation had also given money to a school where Musk's children were attending. Another one was a charity organization run by Musk's brother, a protest group fighting gridlock on Musk's commute to SpaceX. In 2018, Bloomberg reported that Musk had made over $6 million in anonymous donations to the environmental group, the Sierra Club. Musk had asked the group to publicize these donations in order to offset backlash that followed his donations of more than $88,000 to Republican politicians at the time. Number three, investments. Musk has said in the past that he typically only invests money in his own companies. In 2018, Musk himself contributed roughly 90% of the $112.5 million raised that year by his company, The Boring Company, according to the New York Times. However, in recent years, he has also invested undisclosed amounts as a financial backer for tech companies like the artificial intelligence startup DeepMind and the neurotechnology startup NeuroVigil. In 2015, Musk and other entrepreneurs also contributed about $1 billion to fund the Artificial Intelligence Research Lab. Number four, real estate. When he is not busy running multiple companies, Musk is pretty active in the real estate market. After tweeting in early May that he had planned to sell off nearly all of his physical possessions and own no house, the billionaire's multiple properties reportedly hit the market including a 47-acre estate located in Hillsborough, California, a pricey location in the San Francisco Bay Area. That property, which features a 10-bedroom Mediterranean-style mansion built in 1916, has an asking price of around $35 million. In June 2020, Musk reportedly sold a 16,000-square-foot, seven-bedroom mansion in Los Angeles's Bel Air neighborhood for $29 million to a Chinese tech billionaire, NetEase.com CEO, William Ding. The billionaire still owns at least four properties in the Los Angeles area that are worth nearly $15 million combined. Those include a 33,976 square foot property valued at $5 million and a 1,540 square foot property valued at $85,000. Number five, hobbies. In the end, the billionaire enjoys inexpensive hobbies like listening to music, playing video games, and reading books. He doesn't fancy expensive vacations either. He doesn't even take leave days from work. He also hangs out with his kids, visits his friends, and sometimes goes crazy on Twitter. But a good chunk of his time, he spends working on his numerous futuristic projects. Elon Musk has become somewhat of a controversial figure, but his journey to becoming a rocket scientist billionaire remains impressive. And if humanity does end up living on Mars, it could be thanks to Musk's futuristic vision. So there you have it, how Elon Musk makes and spends his billions. What would you do if you had all this money? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Oh, and turn on post notifications.